I warned you. I warned you before now, but you wouldn't listen. You were such a stubborn girl, just like your mother. I want you to stay the hell away from my son. Now, you refused. Is he your son? He is my son, so stay the hell away from him. He even paid for an apartment for you and you became boss of your own, isn't it? Ma, please, I'm sorry. Forgive me, please. She's sorry. Did you hear that? <laughs> <laughs> Ma, she, she must be kidding. There is no room for that. No room anymore. You know why? I have stopped going to church. I don't listen to the word of God anymore. Now you listen to me. I'm going to make you two offers. It's left for you to choose the one you like. But failure to do any of them is death. I'm going to offer you two million naira. Plus the one you and your mother borrowed from me. Take it. Be your chief. He really likes you. He ate you once and mm, your charm held him. So be with chief. If you fail to be with chief, or if you do not want to be with chief, then run. Run as fast as your legs can carry. Run away, if possible, out of this world. Make sure my son will not set his eyes on you. Ma, please. Ma, please, I will run. I choose to run. I will run far away from your son. He will never see me again. I will switch off my phone, ma. Please, just spare my life. Don't hurt me. My mother cannot survive it if anything happens to me. Please. You are such a fool. This is the first time I'm seeing someone that will put honey in her mouth and she will just spit it out. But now you listen to me, but of you. Take this idiot far away. Dump her there. Let her go. It is done, ma. Consider it done. Yeah. Done. Idiot. Now choose the forest where you want to go. I am lost and alone. I am broken inside. I don't know what to do anymore. Can you hear me crying? Can anybody hear my voice? Who can help me now? Oh, can save me now Can you hear me crying? Can anybody hear my voice? Who can help me now? Oh, who can save me now?
some hello boobies. I hope uh, uh, she you like what you're saying. Hi, don't you like what you're saying? Excuse me. Excuse me. Papa, this one I'm even further out. This are not get money. Leave me shock line to see nothing in here. This one I'm even further out. This are not get money. Now pass to him. See, 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 see in clothes. You know even how you're not. I pay me. I just slam them. Papa, sit down, sit down. Chief, they're thinking. I'm not going to sit down. I'm going to rest. How about you? You have that. And a good massage. What's, what's going on here? What's happening here? <laughs> Chill, baby. Chill. What's going on here? <laughs> I know. Hey, Sandra. Lizzie, get out. <laughs> Madam God, I was just trying to welcome our clients. <laughs> Lizzie, out. Madam God, this is not client to me. This is not clients. Come on, get out. Oh. Hey. What's the meaning of this? Sweetheart. Come here. Ah, I've missed you. About this? Oh, never mind. How was your trip, son? Come on, hug your mother. I've missed you so much. Come here. <laughs> I don't understand. Which one is ten thousand? How do you think they run out before? Your body that good? Oh God, calm down. Everything don't add money. Body don't add money. Yeah. If you know they pay ten thousand naira, get out. Which one is make I get out? I don't understand. As I don't come, I don't come. Ah, uh, sure. This is not be fight too. We know they for it. Now my body now your money. And if you don't get money, fuck off. Madam, now 5,000 I go give you. If you know free, tell me, make I go. Which one you say? Make I go. Why you still stand here? Go now. I go go. Go. Make a good day. Go. I go go. What are you worried about? No, what is going on here? I'm asking you. Tata. Mama, why are you doing this? Now get out. Ha. Oh, so make I follow you, they come. You to chop shit. Hey, customer, come on, you price on that. I wait for me, I recall. Mama, does he need a room? Just shut up. Mm -hmm. what, what, is, what is all of this? What's going on? Calm down, son. I need you to calm down. Mm. And you need to start explaining to me what you turned my hotel into. Start explaining. Son, please calm down. What are you telling me to calm down? Calm down for what? I left my hotel, my property into your hands for you to manage. And what do I meet when I come back? A brothel. I came back into the hands of a bunch of prostitutes serving as ushers. Right. Ushering me in and offering me their body. Alright, calm down. Calm down. I will explain. All right? Uh, by the way, Mom, do you live there now? Is that your new home? Because I expected the driver to pick me up from the airport and bring me home where I would receive a warmly welcome from my mother and uh, not the hotel. I said, calm down. Sweetheart, I will explain. All right, calm down. Those girls are designer babes. Mm, super girls. All right, calm down. Remember, few months after opening this hotel, we were at the verge of shutting down. I said to myself, no, I need to employ a manager, which I did. I employed a manager and it was all his idea, you know, to employ this designer babes. Come on, there are several hotels around, big hotels, they do it. You know, it's like a competition, believe me. Ever since we employed these girls. <sighs> Come and see our account. Boom! Excess money everywhere. So please, you need to chill, son. Just calm down. Well, mom, you should have at least informed me. You should have told me about this. Okay? That way we could, you know, sort for some professional advice. Okay? My bad. 
we need to shut down that property completely. Yes. What? I need to renovate the hotel and put it to a very good standard. Oh no. I have said my bad already. Yes, I didn't tell you in the first place, but believe me, that is not possible. I cannot do that. I had an agreement with this manager to raise this hotel to a standard. And we had a two years working time frame. It's not even up to two years yet. It's remaining six months. Sweetheart, please calm down. We have made so much money from this bait. Hmm? All right. After six months, I will hand back the affairs of this hotel to you. You can do anything you want to do, but believe me, after giving it back to you, you will still run back to your mother and you will appreciate me. I did the best. Calm down. Now, why this every time this, this girl is waiting for A1 with the shouts? You only this have you do. See, not see. My girl. Afama. Any important customer don't show. My dear, nobody don't show. Room self don't even fool. This is why you don't get paro. Most of you say I don't get paro. Fine girl like me. I just keep myself. Keep on for the right man. <sighs> that fine guy. That will be fine when you should have brought. <laughs> I ask him to go soon. Which room then? He didn't have a room now. But like this now, I'd like to see the wrong house. Hey! Yes! Because from the look of things, the guy man don't like the activities where they happen around here. And I'm good. Okay, from one year, I got a liar. I got a liar. Lizzie. Mm. You never tire. Mm -mm. No, all this may where you don't lash for this or that. You never do you. I shall all the tire. Ah! Besides, that guy should have just brought, just stole. I just feel like you carry on to me. Oh, yeah, you go. Oh, yeah. Ah! I don't go to show it. You go go find Madame Good son. No more customer for you. You they like what they like. You be like you don't know your mate again. You don't know your mates. Because I come here and I can't stand with you. They shine teeth with you. You don't know me. Have you one collect? No, the reason like that. No, no, small thing like this, you don't know the power. And they owe you five k. Half an hour, you don't know your police to buy you. I go buy you in the way. Don't give me customer to you. Oh. You're in my hotel already. All right then, come in. So Lock, you view to have kept to the timing. I'm sorry for any inconvenience we we must have cost you, ma. I'm here to work so that I can pay you back. I'm ready to work. <laughs> I like that. Very nice. Ma, where can I go and change to into the waitress and dress so that I can start work immediately? What? Waitress. Hello. I am the boss here. I tell you about the job and not the other way around. Sorry. Well, Ma, I, I don't understand what you are saying. Alright. I have to stand to make you understand. Turn around. Whoa. 
You are a beautiful goldfish, meant for the rich and wealthy fishermen. And Ma, I, I still don't understand what you're saying. Oh, please! Snap out of this holier than thou attitude. All right. Plainly. You are here for hookup. So you can pay me. Oh. I shall work. The only woman who has everything all combined in one. Good to see you, Chief. Good to see you too. And how are you today? Very well. My goodness. May I tell you something? Go ahead. I have a fresh package for you, as it is hot. Oh, my goodness. Believe me. In <laughs> fact, this one is what we call fresh wine, straight from the tree. Oh, the way you are describing this fresh wine, I hope it is actually fresher than fresh itself. She is not overnight. Really? Fresh. I am interested. Oh, really? Can I have this wine? Nam, why don't you go to the room? Straight up. <laughs> Let me arrange the girl. Madam Go. You are just one of a kind. All right, sweetheart. I am waiting. Let me bring her. I am waiting. <laughs> and I, I want to receive it hot. <laughs> I'm not going to do any answer. I'm not doing any answer. Don't bring me to this city and come and turn me to a prostitute. God forbid. I'm not doing any answer. I'm not doing any answer. Somebody should be doing a sound walk. I'm going to have a sound walk. Hey. Are you ready? Ma, ma, please, I'm very sorry. I, I cannot do what you want me to do. I came to the city. I thought you wanted me to be a waitress or something. I, I cannot be a prostitute. I mean, it's not possible, man. Oh, really? Is that what you call it now? I shall... Now, you listen to me. I have explained to you what you are here for. And that's exactly what you are going to be doing for me in this place. Are you listening to me? Now, if you are not comfortable with it, I will throw you out and have your mother jailed for life. Simple. Oh, please, oh, please, oh, please, please. I'm sorry if I offended you. Please don't do that to my mother. Why not? Why will I not do it? Give me a reason why I shouldn't jail your mother. Now do you think 2.5 million Naira is a joke? It's not! Are you going to work for me? Or I jail your mother for life? Now get up! Up, 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 up! How is it going to be? I'll work for you, ma. Beautiful! Of course, you do not have a choice. You have to work for me. And you'll be working for me for a year and six months. Oh yes, till I recover my money. And if I don't, you will keep working. You keep working till I recover my money. Is that okay? Ma, you mean I will be sleeping with men for a year and six months? Now you come here. Come, 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 come. 
You don't need to cry. <laughs> what is this for? <laughs> and this? <laughs> Are they for fancy? Oh, come on. I have girl slouch. I need you to follow me so you can change into, you know, something more befitting for the job. And not a drag. Let's go. You better stop crying so you will not spoil your beautiful face. Madam Gold, the golden world. You, you, you spent so much time before coming out of the way. What happened? Ah, Chief. Pardon me, please. I wanted to make sure that, you know, your food is well prepared and safe. <laughs> and I can see it already. Okay. I can see the food that you have served. Mm. Very delicious. Was, oh my God, outstanding. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. You like what you're seeing, oh Chief? Oh my God, I love it. Ah, I actually love it. That means I'm expecting to see a very huge lot. Come on, man. Go, don't go there. You know my bank lot is welcome. I trust you. Yeah, hey, you, you will get it. I trust you. You will get it, sure. <laughs> All right, then. Yes. Chief, carry go. No problem. Nothing to you. Michelle Moza. <laughs> Michelle Moza, let me get visibility. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm already shaking. My dear, uh, uh, can you help me lock the door? Can you just, can you lock it? Manage. Then what? Thank you, my boy. Can you just come close? Can you come as here? Let's get out of business. What is the problem? Uh, well, I think I, I understand your type. You wouldn't want anybody to rush you. I, I am not going to rush you at all. Listen, eh? you, you see this game? I am going to play it exactly how you want it played. And trust me, beautiful one, you are going to enjoy yourself. <laughs> yes. In Anibo. In Rano. Man, you even go. And I asked, what is it? Mama. Mama! What is he? Mama, I hear say my chief stay around. My own chief, my baby. Mama, the bed will tell me that news. Tell me, say you carry and give on that gear. Of course. Yes, I did. I give him a fresh package. Mm-hmm. A man <clears throat> must not eat the same kind of soup all the time. <laughs> but I'm sure Chief is tired of you. <laughs> you give him a fresh package. Of course. Anyone I know of. I gave him a fresh package, a clean babe, full package, all in one. Don't worry, chill very soon. All of you will see her. Oh, now you and I know I'm the hottest in this house. I'm the freshest. Hmm? Yes! Says who? Anyway, Lizzie, I have a fresh babe in this house now. And soon, all of you will get to meet him. But first and first, you have to concentrate on getting for yourself a new client. Please leave me. So please, I am not used to this kind of life. You don't, need to, you don't need to tell me. I am already looking at you now. You have not done this thing before. I know. Look at look at even this gift of Mother Teresa that you are wearing on your neck. I cannot, I already know the kind of person you are. But even if you have not done it before, that this is this is going to be your first time. Trust me, you are going to enjoy yourself. Can you just come to me? Now? Please, sir. It's okay. I just wish I can go, please. You can no longer go. 
We have already entered into business transaction. See, the door is already locked. You know it yourself. Listen there. Eh? Money will be paid to Madam Gold for this transaction. Under normal circumstances, we are not supposed to receive any money. But because I have come to love you, I am going to remit significant amount of money to you if only you will play this game. Do you have an account number? Just test, test me your account number. I don't have account number, sir. You don't have account number? Yes. Settled. I am going to open bank account for you today. In a very good bank. Just come, come, just come. Just look, don't worry yourself. I will take I will take it easy. I will just make you get used to me. And you will to enjoy yourself. And this also more. You will be in a bed because I can work. <laughs> wait, 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 Madam Good. Surely they try to tell me now, say you carry chief. My own chief. Where well, I already carry my skills, whoa. You carry fresh and give up. In my hand, I'm a chief. If I go to him, shall I? Why you carry chief? Go give fresh. Surely you won't lose our customer because I don't know what that's. Madam Good. Okay, I'm going to get it. As in Madame Gould, the wife. Had it been, you were doing all those things. Would Chief had left you? He wouldn't have. He was the one who ate the fresh food and got stopped. Shame on you. <laughs> now listen to me. If you keep giving a man same sexual style all the time, you stand the risk of losing that man. Now, Elizabeth, if you don't mind, can you leave me and get your ass busy? Oh, God. Lizzie. Madam Gold. Chief, no easy like that, too. Chief, no easy like that. Not go Not go You don't go carry a gift for another person. She, you know what I do for Chief. It's a using a one style they give up. How? I go bend down like this, I go turn like this, and then they say, Buddy, I don't know why you are why you are just feeling bad as if you have committed an abomination. We only enjoyed ourselves. And trust me, you are so sweet. I am not disappointed at all. I, I, I just I just wish you will realize that you have actually stolen my heart away. If not for the business I have to pursue, in the next 30 minutes, I would have actually said that we'll stay here and we'll enjoy ourselves all day. But trust me, my dear, I am coming back for you. And when I come back, I will come back for good. Stop crying, my dear, stop. Can you just stop? <laughs> beautiful girl beautiful girl outside beautiful girl inside it, you have made a friend in me trust me you will never regret this okay okay stop crying hmm, chief chief you're too much I got extra a lot hmm? from you. Oh, wow. <laughs> trust, Madam Good. Come on, trust me. I will always give you the best. I mean, the very best. For you? <laughs> okay, then. Take it. Mm? Just like some pastors used to say, take it and you receive it, chief. She's all yours. <laughs> of course, of course. Of course, I'll see you soon. I will. Thank you, chief. Mm -hmm. Hey! You are good. What did you do to Chief? I mean, 
Whatever it is you did to him, keep it up. He likes it. In fact, he's in love with it. Did you know Chief sent me extra money? Because of what, what you gave him. You are good though. Mm. <laughs> All right, calm down. I'm going to take you for shopping, okay? Let's go shop, you know, to get you more sexy, classy outfits. I do not joke with men like Chief, believe me. Oh, come on, stop crying. Hmm? What happened to you? So I'm okay. I'm fine. You're obviously not okay. So talk to me, alright? Were you hurt or something? Sir, please go about your business and leave me alone. Leave me, let me wallow in my pain and sorrow. I'll be fine. You can't use such strong words to describe your situation and you're still okay. So please, talk to me. <laughs> you might never know, I, I could be of help. Sir, 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 I've ruined. Sir, I have ruined my life. This, this is not the kind of life I planned for myself. Take it easy, okay? Calm down and explain everything to me. Right? That is my story, sir. And... I never knew this was the kind of life I was going to live in the city. When I left my village to come and work for her in the city, I didn't know that she would ask me to start working as a prostitute. I didn't plan this kind of life for myself, sir. And the worst part is that you. Sir, the frustrating thing is that if I decline, she, she will punish my mother and I. I didn't know when she became so mean and too money driven. I'm, I'm really sorry about this, okay? I will, it's fine. I will talk to her, okay? And see how I can be of help. Yes, because this is totally unacceptable to me. Hey, sir, please, I'm begging you. Do not put me in more trouble. I'm begging you. Just allow me to do this. I shall work in peace. At least, I'll, I'll, I'll have the money to pay her back it's, if I work for her. It's, it's okay. It's all right. I, like, I just like, need my mother and I to be in peace. Let's live in peace. Okay. All right. Like I said, I'll see how I can be of help. And I've got to be honest with you. I feel pity for you. But do not worry. I will talk to her and uh, have everything sorted out. Okay? Sir, please do not mention my name. Please. It's okay. Don't tell I use. 
it to I'm the one that sent you. It's okay. It's okay. It's all right, okay? Listen to me. I did not know what got us, Madam Go picked you from. First, it was my targeted client, Chief, that was given to you. Now, you're messing around with my handsome Chimezi, Madam Go's son. Madam Go's son? Mm. You want to tell me you don't know he's Madam Go's son? Well, I do not know. And I do not know you either. But one thing I am sure of is that I don't have strength for all this. Unless I forget, in case Madame Gold picked you from the gutters, I, Judith, I am not from the gutters. Mm -hmm. I am from a reputable family. <laughs> Excuse me. I shall not get a reputation. See, let me tell you, you say in this place, better go and ask questions. Unga doggy vam 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 in this place. Unga doggy vam vam vam. Hey, it's Madam Gold discussing this thing. It's Madam Gold. Easy. Easy, why now? Mom, I met this girl at the hotel, mm. and uh, I, I must say I'm not so comfortable with her story. Mom, do you know traffic girls into prostitution? I beg your pardon? What nonsense is that? Is it because I've been tolerating you ever since you returned? Huh? Mom, oh, when did you become this heartless? To ruin a girl's life only because she came to you for help when you were in a position to comfortably help her. I'm going to make that payment. Okay? And once I'm done, I need her to leave that place. Oh, no! You would do no such thing. That girl remains there. Mom! And that's fine now. Mother! Hey! Now you listen to me. Stop it. All right? I need you to stay the hell away from my business. So I will not fall out with you. Mother. Hey! Mother, anyway, since when did you become this mean? Oh, just shut up. You care for drink? Hell no. Yes, Mama. Only you 15. You have 15 runs. You don't trust me. Wait, oh. 15 runs. You have made me proud. Oh. Come on, girl, with <laughs> these two pointy acts. Come on. Turn around. Oh, yeah, mwah. Oh, yeah, mwah. Oh, get it, Beva. Oh, get it, Beva. <laughs> Now we they run this time. I am proud of you. Thank you, Mama. My goodness. Yeah. I have a gift for you. Wow. Do not tell others. No, I I'm want going to, to add something, you know, to your money. <laughs> <laughs> Who am I seeing? Ah! Look at that. Chief! <laughs> what is going on? Modern gold for gorgeous. Chief, Chief! You will never stop being beautiful. Where is this one? My, my darling, please. Run along. All right. Run right. along. How are you today? I'm fine, Chief. Yeah. This one you were enjoying yourself with something? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Good, Good to see you. You're welcome. I'm going to look in herself. Oh, thank you, Chief. How, so, but what is going on? You didn't tell me you were coming. Well, I am sorry. But as you can see, the politicians. They have destroyed this country. I know. Nothing is working anymore. Mm. Business is just like standstill. I know. So I decided to come and unwind. 
You know, your place is the place of happiness. You can say that again. Where, where men come to enjoy themselves. Oh, give me this. And then, the thought of that, uh, that one you gave me the, the other time, uh, the thought has not left me. Mm. I, I kept thinking of, you know, you understand what I'm saying? Mm. And that is why I am back. Chief. Uh, uh, to see if you can arrange her for me again. Why not? Uh, uh, this time around, I want her to remain with me until we can... <laughs> Chief, <laughs> you know it will cost you. Oh, don't worry, I am not just able, I am capable. I know, I trust you. Ego ne. All right, Chief. Yeah. Why don't you sit? Okay. You know, let me arrange uh, for something for you to eat um, and drink. Can you quality be drinking your own in the meantime? Oh, with your pleasure. Uh, but I, I can see that you are mixing it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we, we don't mix. Uh -huh. we, we drink raw. Oh, really? We, we original. Me, I like to mix and no, no, mix no, we, and we don't, mix. We don't mix. I know. Uh -huh. no All problem. right, then let me arrange uh, for food, then drinks for you. Go ahead. Okay, so I can tell them to tidy up your room. You know you did not tell me you were coming uh, now. But you, finally, I am here. You normally come on weekends. It shouldn't be an issue. I am here. Oh, uh, yeah, 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 we be here. I am I I can equally be going through your books, I can read my book. Well, you my hero, my nonsense All these has to stop. Today marks the end of all your activities in this place. Because me, I cannot afford to watch all those men put you through what they are putting you through right now. Okay? Your mother don't see it that way. She feels a papa like me does not deserve a better life. Shh, don't use such words on yourself again. Look, all you have to do is to believe that everything will be all right. Okay? I, 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 I just wish that God can just fast forward my life. Or he will just send somebody to send me an alert of 2.5 million in my account. But why? I will just pack the money and give your mother so that I will not do this. I shall walk. It's, it's, hey. it's okay. It's all right. Okay. I, I, I will sort it out. It's okay. It's okay. Hey! So, what is going on here? Welcome, ma. So, this is where you are. And Chief has been at the bar waiting for you. I'm sorry, ma. I'll go and see him now. She is going nowhere. What is this, son? She has to go. And now. Ma, ma, sorry, I, I will go and see him. I will go. Good for you. And do not keep him waiting. Forget about my mom, okay? What I say is what will stand. Right? I want to go and do the ice. I won't walk. You want to do what? In fact, as a matter of fact, let me let me, let me go and see that mother. Like, no, come, come, come here. Come oh, here. Don't, don't, don't do it like that. Bro. Hello. I hear you are the one looking for my girl. I don't understand. Who are you, please, and uh, who are you referring to? What don't you understand? The part that I just said that you are the one looking for my girl or what? Look, let me let me let me let me just sound it at the one. Little wonder why you people go through a lot of problem. I don't understand. How can an old man, old enough to be her father, you're here looking for this this young girl? Somebody who is old enough to be your daughter. Hey. Eh? That's why you go ahead and carry hey. on unknown diseases. Listen to me. I don't know what is wrong with you. I don't know who you are. But I don't understand why you are here questioning my style of life. Is, who, your, your, him. your style of life is not my business. What is my business is when next you come here looking for my girl. Are you, are you, are you sick in the head or something? Look at the prostitute who is in a brothel. Now, Tulakia. Making money for yourself and your family is basically you're calling your girl. And you're vibrating like this. Before me. I am not a prostitute, sir. You're not a prostitute? Yes. Well, then why do you want to be collecting money? That boy. If you want to know how sick I am. Yeah. If you really want to know how sick I can get. 
the very time that I hear or see you any inch close to her again, then you will understand how sick I can be. Come here. Look at this one. Come here. Look, 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 look at this one. Are you, are, you, are you sick or what? what is going on? Since when did I start? I... What Hello? is going on here? What is going on here? You, you didn't see what, what was going on? No, you didn't chief. see it? No, Chief, please. Who was that Chief that just left here now? <sighs> Since when did you start bringing Chief around here? Please calm down, Chief. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Listen, I am already calm. No, Chief. The reason I am threatening this thing today is because I didn't come with my boys. The main fact that I come here to unwind on a low key is not the reason anybody should insult me. I am leaving this place. Chief, I'm begging. This is no longer the place I used to know. No, Chief, come down. All the money I plan to spend here, I'm leaving with the money. No! No, 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 Chief, this please! Is a, this is the place we come to enjoy ourselves. Since I when know. did you start keeping chimpanzee here to be something people? Chief, I need you to calm down, I please! I don't deal with chimpanzee, I deal with human beings. Chief, I need that money badly! The money's gone. Hey! How can you talk like that, Chief? Who is doing this to me? Who wants to spoil my business? Oh, no, 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 no! When it comes to money, Ngapwala! Oh, Chief! Chief! Chief, please! I need you to calm down, Chief! Chief, please, I need that money badly! What is going on here? Where are these girls? Now, what exactly is wrong with you? Are you out of your mind or something? Mom, I am deeply in love with that girl called Judith. What? Okay? Yes. My heart craves for her. She's the one who completes me. Aren't you ashamed of yourself? I'm asking you, are you mad? How dare you talk about developing feelings for a cheap prostitute? Prostitute that you turn her into. And then all of a sudden you're pained because I'm trying to bring her out of that trap. Now look, mom, if you want us to coexist peacefully in this house, then you have to exonerate that poor girl of any transactions that you have made with that shameless he-dog. No, you watch it! Watch your tongue, young man. Do not forget, I gave back to you. Now you listen to me. I will not sit and watch you speak about falling in love with a cheap prostitute. Never! Don't you dare. My last warning. Mommy, I am in love with that girl and nothing anyone, not even you, can do about it. Young man, come back here. Did you just point your finger towards your mother? Now you sit down. Sit down! My, you sent for me. You can use your chance on Chief. I mean, I do not have issues with that. It simply means more money for us, right? I am innocent of all this, ma. I don't use chance. Oh, shut up! I shall be the one to judge you if you are innocent or not. And as a matter of fact, you are guilty. Now, let me give you this as a last warning. I want you to stay the hell away from my son. Else, you will not like what I would do to you and your mother. Is it because I have not thrown you out and have your mother jailed? Please, Mom. Mom, whatever I'm doing with you, do not involve my mother, please. As in, we're having conversation now. As in, you're my best friend now. Again, you see, okay? How will you get out? I brought you here to tell you to stay away from me. Please. 
This is my cross. Allow me carry it alone. I cannot allow you to continue doing what you obviously don't like. Yes, you don't. Please, allow me to help you. You see, you cannot help me. Your mother has warned me to stay away from you. That she never wants to see me around you. Judith, I love you. Yes. The few moments we've spent together talking, chatting, and just it's actually showed me that we can actually work on something really interesting and special together. Please. I, I, I feel the same way for you too. But I am not the girl for you. I, I am not the girl for you. I don't befit your class. What are you doing? I am sorry. Leave me alone. You know what? Let, let's go somewhere with you, okay? Missy. Missy. Missy, this girl has told you. She has told you she's not befitting for you. This is what is befitting for you, Meze. Ha! Hmm. Customer! Hey, what did they ask me? This one way down my walker pass like this. Like, say, me and my person, they fight. What did they <laughs> Oh, well, I wait till they ask. The man won't try me, oh. He might look at me now. That man won't try me. He won't try the ball, the ball. Now I give him one bad sign. Bad one. I hit her, hit her, hit her, hit her. I carry her. Keep her for bed. Now the man shot. Wah! Run. The man not strong. Go. That kind of thing, I know they collect him again. Wait, do they run? So now, so go sit down, JJ, like this one day. They will carry person, husband or person, brother, walk up past here. Say, I don't kill him for this brothel. When I go put madam for trouble. Ha! Nobody go die. No, they talk like that now. Nah. Nobody. They, you don't forget say we don't always pray before we start work. I be just forget to say yeah, they do this kind of work. Oh, I know God though. I know God pass you where down here. So I know they know they young that kind of thing. Hello, ma. Good afternoon, ma. Yes, very clean. Oh, no, ma. She went out with your son. Okay, ma. Then what's up? Any show? Any better for me? I don't call like this. Uh, Say, Chief, one come. Uh, but like this now, as a meet, don't follow Madame Pekin come out. Uh, I don't know. I feel like saying, I need to come go do the work. Why they not like that? I know they. I did here and I don't come out now. I be announced. You know they see what I carry. Why they talk like carry, carry the leads, give me. Now my run the package. You know they like black people. I know black, I chocolate now. Check me out now. I be hot chocolate. So your color be like Milo. Choco Milo. Oh, I send my picture. I better shift. Send my picture, give me. If you collect me now, as I said now, look at me. Flat on me, beat me and beat me. Let's go, Roger, me go buy me dough. I go be, I go send. Chief, it's not like chief. 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 Chief, there's this style I learned. Like, like that. From, from, from internet. I'll pin down and I'll hang out. I'll, I'll keep my leg in the back and then you enter from. How you like it? Chief, 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 chief. Hey. Chief, chief. Hey, 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 hey,
Madangot. Madangot. Chief threw me out of his room. What to room? He said I'm not Judith. That I'm not appetizing like Judith. How? 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 I'm wearing the next clothes. It's open. Oh, my bad, my bad. I'm opening it more. It's open. Chief, it's open. <laughs> I should tell him what. Chief, this time I learned Madam God can testify it. I told him more. Oh, he's not saying anything. Okay. Ma? I don't know if she's back. I don't know. I don't know. She went out with your son since morning. Yes. Ah, ah. Ma? See that she went out. Her eyes saw them with my two eyes. I even went there. Judith has not seen any customer today. In a good Ma, quickly, you maybe in that same full time. When you're called chief, I'm still standing in 103. Call chief. Chief, Judith is not around. Madam Potts, I should tell you that Judith is not around, though. Chief, I added pussy sweet in her. It will be sweet. Hey. Ma. No, no, Madam Good, you have to work on Chief. You have to work on Chief. Chief cannot leave me like this, so you have to work on Chief. Chief is my customer. Hey. No, no. Are you out of your mind? Have I not told you to stay the hell away from my son? And you refused. Instead of you to focus on the reason you are here, you said no. All you do now is to use chair on my son. And you think I will sit, open my eyes and watch you do what you want to do. Hell no! Mom, please, I'm sorry. I, 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 did, I, I didn't do anything. You're accusing me of my... I tried my best to push me away, but he refused to leave Already? Ma. Now, have you seen the money you made me lose? You know me. I am money. Money is me. I had to lose money. I don't even want to lose a couple! Now, what you are going to do for me is to pack all your dirty rags. You are leaving this hotel. This minute, you are not going to spend up to 10 seconds. Starting from now, one, I count. Two, oh, one, please. two. Oh, please, I'm begging you, please. please. Are you exchanging words with me? Mm. Now I count. One, two, three. God punish you dead. It's okay. I'm, I'm, I'm here now, okay? It's all right. I feel so humiliated. So tell me, what exactly happened? She got angry that I went out with you. She started shouting that a certain client came and was asking after me. I guess it's that same chief. She was so angry and bitter. She said I made her lose a lot of money today. 
It's okay. It's all right. I, I'm here now. You have me here. I've got you covered. Okay? It's it's even better it happened. Because, I mean, this... This whole place is no longer conducive for you. So I'm going to take you somewhere far away from her. Where she will not have easy access to you. Okay? Yeah. I'll do that. Alright? Not having to sell you up to some men for some what cheap money. I'll take care of you. Okay? This is where you'll be staying till I'm able to sort things out. Alright? No. I, I, I am happy. I'm afraid. I am confused. I, I don't know what to say. Thank you. Like I said, I've got you. I've got you for life. You deserve everything beautiful. Nobody has ever done such a thing for me before. It's okay. It's all right. Hey. <laughs> 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 Now, where is she? Yes. I know she will come back running to you. So, where is that girl? I don't understand. Mom, you sent her packing. How come you're asking me about her? Now, you listen to me, son. I have told you this, but I'm going to repeat it again till it sings in your head. I will never be alive to watch you marry that girl. Never! That girl is a cheap prostitute, a slut. She is not good to be my daughter-in-law. She is not good for you, but she is good for my business and that's it. You will never repeat that word again. Marriage, never, not in this house. I will never allow you marry that girl. She is nothing but a cheap slut. If you do, I will make sure I make your life and hers miserable. Now, listen, I mean every word. Not because you've made little money, you claim you've forgotten me. Remember, I'm still your mother, Madam God. One more word from you. What? Any problem? I, I want to thank you for everything you have done for me. Why I don't 
don't know how to repay you. You don't have to say anything. I know God will repay you. But don't you think you are doing too much? You're my joy. You're my happiness. It is my responsibility to make sure that you're happy. When you're happy, I'm equally happy. Okay? <laughs> you can't be thanking me for my happiness. Because that's what you are. I'm scared. I'm so scared. Your mother, if she finds out that I'm still seeing you, she will deal with me ruthlessly. I know my mom has threatened you and all of that. She won't do anything to hurt you. Or me. Yes, yeah. she won't do anything to hurt me. So, don't worry. I will not let her know your whereabouts. Okay? You're safe with me. I don't know why this assurance is not working for me. I'm still scared. Baby, you're safe with me. Okay? I love you. Okay? Just like instructed, mm -hmm. we found them together. Mm -hmm. We now know where she stays. Good. That's a good one. Now I want you people to lie here. Stop trailing me. Just hold on to the address. Alright? Mm -hmm. I will now tell you the next line of action. And that's it. Correct, ma'am. Take note of that. No problem. Just go to the bar and have any drink you want. Alright, man. <clears throat> Thank you so much, man. No, go finish my this in the room. Just a minute. Just a minute. That's it. Alright, the chief. Oh. Hello, chief. Oh. Chief, calm down now. Please. And once I see your call like this, as in, my heart will just jump. Oh, calm down. It has not gotten to that. Listen, Chief, I promise you, this girl will come back to you. She's all yours. Just, just relax, relax, relax. I give you my word. She will come back to you. Please, just calm down. I've heard you, Chief. And you are. Yay! Chief is madly in love with this idiot wants to spoil my business for me, this girl.
Now what is this, son? I have noticed you've been uneasy. It's nothing, Mom. I'm fine. I will never allow that girl come into your life again. Never. Judith! 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 Madame Gould. Mama. She be Judith, don't fuck up. Carry my customer, give me back. Give me back my customer. I need you for my life, oh. I need them for my life. Hey, 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 please. Do not give me a headache. Chief will come back. All right? He will return to you, but for now, he is upset. So we have to take it easy. Let me see how, you know, I'll go about it. You don't talk, no. I trust you. Any burun nukwara jenya another customer, please. Let me see if you love us. So much fun. Where's Judith? Where did she go? Huh? Where could she have gone to without even saying a word? you before now but you wouldn't listen you were such a stubborn girl just like your mother I want you to stay the hell away from my son now you refused is he your son he is my son so stay the hell away from him he even paid for an apartment for you and you became boss of your own isn't it Please, I'm sorry. Forgive me, please. She's sorry. Did you hear that? <laughs> <laughs> Ma, she, she must be kidding. There is no room for that. No room anymore. You know why? I have stopped going to church. I don't listen to the word of God anymore. Now you listen to me. I'm going to make you two offers. It's left for you to choose the one you like. But failure to do any of them is dead. I'm going to offer you two million naira. Plus the one you and your mother borrowed from me. Take it. Be a chief. He really likes you. He ate you once and mm, your charm held him. So be with chief. If you fail to be with chief, or if you do not want to be with chief, then run. Run as fast as your legs can carry. Run away, if possible, out of this world. 
make sure my son will not set his eyes on you. Ma, please. Ma, please. I will run. I choose to run. I will run far away from your son. He will never see me again. I will switch off my phone, ma. Please, just spare my life. Don't hurt me. My mother cannot survive it if anything happens to me. Please. You are such a fool. This is the first time I'm seeing someone that will put honey in her mouth and she will just spit it out. But, now you're listening to me, both of you. Take this idiot far away. Dump her there. Let her go. It is done, ma. Consider it done. Yeah, done. Idiot. Now choose the forest where you want to go. I am lost and alone. I am broken inside. I don't know what to do anymore. Can you hear me crying? Can anybody hear my voice? Who can help me now? Oh. Save me now. Can you hear me crying? Can anybody hear my voice? Who can help me now? Oh, who can save me now? yourself because of this girl. She is nothing but a gold vigor. Let her go. She might have followed a wealthier man and you're here stressing yourself. Oh, please. I'm begging you. If I just hope you don't have your hands in that poor girl's disappearance. Mommy, please, if you know anything or if you know about her whereabouts, please, just let her go. That was stupid. Who transes that? How dare you accuse me? Now look at me very well. Do I look like a kidnapper to you? I'm asking you! How dare you? Now you are the prime suspect here. Of course. You were with her before she disappeared. So I ask, son, where is she? What? What's what? Hey. 
Have you seen it? Did I not tell you that that girl is not good for you? She is nothing but a gold digger. A liar. A cheap slut. I am your mother, sweetheart. I know what's good for you. That girl is not good for you. Come on, take a look at you. I'm a master on one. And you want to settle for less. Hell no. Now just take a look at your face. You already look like someone who has been dumped. She has dumped your ass. To me, what happened, Judith? For no more. Talk to me, Judith. Water. Water. Talk to me first now. You need water. Okay. I'll get you water. Hey! Is this the reason you came back to the country? I'm asking you. Why would you allow a commoner, as an ordinary cheap prostitute, to wear you down like this? Ah, this is wrong. Why don't you concentrate on the reason you came back to the country? Which is a project. A very big project. Why this girl? I love her so much more. Oh. I'm not here to argue whether she is or she's not a prostitute. No. That's an act which you forced her into, by the way. Besides, it's in her past. And I believe we both have our pasts. Oh, baby, please, calm down. A prostitute will remain a prostitute. Hmm? That girl is not good enough for you. I am your mother, and I'm telling you to your face. Now are you going to die because this girl left you? Hmm? I need to see her more. See her where? I'm asking you where? Where are you going to look for her? I hope you are not asking me to help you go look for the girl because I do not have time. Oh, come on. It is time for my manicure, my pedicure, everything cure. And that's it. I don't need your help more. I'll go looking for her myself. How does that serious? All right. 
come in. Let me give you something to eat, at least for you to have energy. You know. Mm. Are you sure you do not need energy to go look for the girl? Oh, my God. <laughs> so because of money, Madame Gold did all this to you. But why didn't you come back, Judith? You should have come back immediately. Mama. Mama, I don't want to come back so that she will not come back here and start disgracing me. It pains my heart. I had to do as she says. Everything was going smoothly until her son fell in love with me. Madame Gold became so angry and furious. Mm. She said that I'm not befitting of her son. Mm -hmm. mm. <laughs> Hi. With all this that she has done to you, it shows she wants you to stay clear of her son. And you just have to do that, my daughter. Stay clear of Madame Gold and everything that concerns her, including the son, please. But Mama, Mama, he loves me so much. And I love him too. But she is his mother. She is. The only crime we committed is that we are poor. And in our time of need, we ran to her for help. <laughs> She was discharged from the hospital yesterday. Discharged? Yes. Like this? Who discharged her? It's the doctor. He, 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 we, don't, we don't have money again, so he said we should start going home. But he diagnosed her with a terminal disease. He said she needs surgery as soon as possible, ma. Even at that! He shouldn't have discharged this woman like this. Look at the way she breathes. Eh? Are you not hearing it? Now, where is the love of Christ? Does this doctor not go to church? I mean, why do we go to church to listen to the word of God? Ha! My good friend. Please, Ma, please help me. Please, do not let my mother die like this. Please, please help us. Please get up. Please, you must not kneel to beg me. Hmm? So, Ma, so, Ma. Hmm. How much did they even request it from the hospital? 2.5 million, Ma. Hmm? Speak. Speak. Hmm. <laughs> well, your mother is my good friend. We have come a long way. You will not understand. She is my best friend. In fact, your mother is the only person I can come back to the village and I will come and visit her. It's only your mother. Yes, 2.5 million is not a small money. But no problem. I'm going to bring out the money from my business account. Hey! Ma. But my problem now is, if I borrow you people this 2.5 million naira, when your mom recovers, how would you people pay me back? Like I said, I'm going to bring this money from my business. Ma, ma, that will not be a problem. Ma, please, the first thing is for me to save my mother's life. I, I will pay the money. Anyhow, I will walk, I will hustle, I will do things. It's I'm strong, right. I will hustle. I will, I, 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 it's alright, Judith. No problem, I will give the money. 
I want our friends for. I hear the word of God. Mm. I go to church. I listen to the word of God. Mm. It's always good to give. Yes, ma. I will you. give. So first thing tomorrow morning, yes, I'll ma. bring the money. Oh, my thing. Thank you. So it's all right. Just Thank make you, sure you take her to the hospital for the surgery. That's all. I will immediately once I see the money. Boom, I'm there, ma. I don't understand what you're talking about. Honestly, I don't. Uh -uh. Did your daughter not tell you that I did not dash you this money for your surgery? I borrowed you people this money. Listen, my friend, I do not run charity organization. Mm -mm. Okay, now I understand. Please calm down. Calm down. You know your mother and this money. You know, when she told me of your assistant, I was honestly so happy that it came from you, not from an outsider. Because you and I are one, sisters. Are we not? Not on this money matter. Please. Why are you little back? Welcome back, my daughter. Welcome. Welcome, Judith. I'm glad you're back now. I have been waiting for you at least to come clear the issue on ground. By the way, where are you coming from? Looking all dressed. Oh, <laughs> um, I am coming from a friend's place. Oh. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. You are pretty. Uh -huh. You are good for business. Thank you for your compliments, ma. But good for business, I don't get that. Well, never mind. Your mother here claims that she is not aware that I borrowed that money to you people for her surgery. Hmm? Did I not tell you that I borrowed that money myself from my business? Do you want my business to close down? No, no ma'am. Um, I actually Just explained to my mother. But she said that you both are friends. That money can never separate your friendship. Yes. We are friends and sisters in the Lord. Not like she's my biological sister. I mean, you should have told her that I borrowed this money to you people for her surgery. I mean, all right, all right. Now that both of you are here, hmm, I'm going to give both of you at least three months to pay me back. And if I give you this three months, remember, it will be exactly one year. Have I not tried? You have, you have. Uh -uh. You this much. money is long overdue now. Thank you, hmm? Thank you, very much. <laughs> um, thank you so much, ma'am. I really do appreciate what you did for my mother. But I promise you, I'll pay. I'm ready. I'm ready to do anything. I will walk. I will, I will do anything. I'm going to raise the money. Seriously, ma. I like it. I've been on that. I like it. I like when you say you can do anything, you can hawk. I like that one. Boys, bring the woman out! Is she not stronger than you guys? Move! Move! You move it! I got the one you move! Move it, Keep moving! Madam Gold. Please. What is this? Please. please, just give us a little time. I will pay you this money, please. Please, ma. Please, ma. Madam Gold. You've been a friend and a sister to me. I don't have the money. I don't have the money. Oh, really? Why do you always like to call me your sister? Take a good look at me. Do I look like you? I'm just your friend and your sister in the Lord. So stop all these sister things. And you, get up. This was how you knelt when you were begging for this money. You lied to me. Habib, get up. Why has it become a crime to save a friend's life? You know, we didn't say it's a crime that you saved my mother's life. Ma, we really do appreciate what you did for us. But please, I'm just asking for you to give me time to work and save up the money. I will pay you. Oh, really? Yes, yeah. 
Now the only time I'm going to give to you is for you to walk in my firm. Walk in my firm, then pay me the money your mother is owing. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, Ma, you know that I cannot leave. Mm. I cannot leave my mother here alone and come to the city to work for you. Can you imagine? A beggar that has a choice. Hi. Who told you you have a choice? Oh, yeah. Take these people away! Come on, come on, I got the one. I got the one. Ma, okay. where we say move? You move it! And please hold Standing back, pass it by Louis. Okay, so. I will go with you, please, ma'am. I will. It's just that, just give me some days to prepare, please. Please. All right. Because I'm too kind. Because I hear the word of God often. So I'm going to give you just one week. One week! If I don't see you after a week, I will return here. <laughs> Then, be ready to pay me with interest and my watering interest. Hey. Oh, come on, enough. Try your taste. Madam, you push pushing hard to because of my salary. Hey. 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 But where did I go wrong? Tell me, where did I go wrong? I thought she wanted you to work with her, like she said. I never knew she wanted you to join prostitution. Hey! Arrow! My own daughter. Look at what I'm putting you through. I'm so sorry, my dear. So sorry. Hi. Madam Gold. I must stop crying. It's not your fault. You are not the one that asked your body to develop an illness. It just happened, Hi. Mama. Masi. Madam Gold is a heartless oh woman. My God. She does not have any atom of mercy in her. But do not worry, Mama. Because I know that the God we are serving will answer our prayer one day. Everything is going to turn around. And all our soul will turn into joy. Amen to that. Amen. Oh, Madam God. Somebody I called a friend. We were like sisters. Whatever went wrong. Hi, hey. one. It's okay, my daughter. So sorry. So sorry. Oh, will be well, like you said. Mm -hmm. Oh, my so happy with family. It's okay, my daughter. It's okay. Judith, where are you? I need to see you. Something tells me my mom is behind us. Yes. I'm wondering the kind of threat she must have dished out. I would make her want to leave hurriedly, even without even saying goodbye to me. Not even a hug. Where are you, Judith? Where on earth are you? Please listen to me. You have to stop calling me. Please. Can you please just grant me the request of seeing you? Please. You are making things difficult for me. Please. Stop calling me. Please.
She caught the phone on me. She, she, she hung up on me. She, she just called me for the first time now. Uh, and she, she, she hung up on me. Problem without solution, is that clear? What is it this time around? Mama, it's not that easy. What is not that easy? He's been calling me. <laughs> Mama, I've not been taking his calls. It's not that easy for me, Mama. They say he's the only man that has ever shown me true love and care. Judith, my dear, I understand you. But his mother does not want you. She does not. And I honestly would not pray for you to have a woman like that as a mother-in-law. Madam Gold is wicked and you must avoid her. Please. Please. Okay, Mama, it's not that easy. But I will try. Please do. I'll try. Do. And avoid that man completely. Oh? At the appointed time, God will send you a good man. Somebody that will so love you. Yes. It's possible. Remember, with God, all things are possible, my dear. It's okay. It's okay. <sighs> Madam God, what is the meaning of this? I mean, why are you doing this? I came here with high expectation, with enthusiasm, expecting you to do something, to tell me something reasonable. Not this thing you are telling me now. It's okay, Chief. I understand. But believe me, I'm working on something. How Please. long am I going to give you, Madam God? No, tell me the time you need. Can't you see that I am dying slowly? Hmm? No, can't you see that this is not me? Can't you see I'm no longer functioning in my full element at Sifondum? That something is wrong. Yes, I love this girl. I love this girl and I want to meet her. Why are you not helping me do that? Chief. We meet again. I can't remember the name now, but I'm guessing you're here to meet her. To show you Judith. Or rather still, someone who looks like Judith. Did she tell me? She sent her packing because of you! Now watch it! Watch it, son! Oh, she did. I see. You see, men like you grow so old physically, yet stupidly mentally. What? Yes. Now, you are the reason why bribery, corruption, sacrilege will never leave this country alone. Shut up. Ignore that. Please. This. Chief, I will handle Listen. This. Let this be the last time this boy will insult me. Yes. Listen to me. One that boy, he must have to stop. Because the next time this repeats itself, I'm going to go all out. And when I go all out, I'm not going to mind the person who will get crushed. Oh, darling, darling, calm down. Nobody will get crushed. Chief! Messi! Messi! Chief Messi! Chief Messi! Come back here! What is 
wrong with you? Can you stop this nonsense? Stop it! You should remember that you no longer run the affairs of this hotel. It doesn't matter if it belongs to you or not. So stop it! Stop embarrassing Chief. Else, I will allow him to deal with you in his own way. He can't do anything to me. Really? You know why? Because his money, cheap Naira notes, only controls those who would listen to him because of how much they get from him. Not me. Mom, I am way, I am much more above him. Okay? I do not want to see that man's presence in this place. Okay? It's not possible. Else, else, I will not stop embarrassing. Oh, shut up! Stop this rubbish! As far as I'm concerned, son, chief is part and parcel of the hotel. So stop chasing this man away because of your stupid obsession. Can you imagine yourself? You are killing yourself over a girl. He already had. Isn't that a shame? Yes. True. He's had her already. I, I'm not disputing that with you at all. Okay? And you try to sell Judith off like something to him. I'm not disputing the fact that he's had her already. But as long as I live and exist, he will never have her again. Oh, well, let's see how it goes. You know, sometimes I wonder why you place so much priority on other person's interest over your son's. Because of what? Money? Mm-mm. Mm-mm. You don't get it. Not because of money, but because your choice is not good enough. And that's it. Says a woman who has completely sold her conscience over some narrow notes. <sighs> Well, I was just wondering uh, if you have found your supposed lover. I mean, you've been silent, you know, lately. Ooh, Mom. Son Judith, of course. You are such a pretender. Mom, since when did you start? Caring so much about my love life. Oh, come on, sweetheart. I mean, I can see you are stable now. So I was just wondering if you've gotten for yourself a new, beautiful, smart girl. Other than that stupid idiot. <laughs> Spare me that, Mom. <laughs> oh, listen, Mom. It is either Judith or nobody. Okay? Really? Yes.
Mama. Mama. I'm back. Oh. That woman, eh? You see the way I was prizing my fish. So it's just making me this one. As in, eh? I know. Mama. She has gone to. She didn't tell me she was going anywhere. Just so that let me rush and get something off of her. That is not around. That means not around. So where did she go to? Hey. Oh. Who is this? Let's get from the top of the table. If you want to see your mother, come to the city with my money and bail her. Come to the city with my money. Jesus! 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 Mother and God! Mother and God! Mama! It's only it's only Nancy. It's only me. Jesus. God I me. God of my God. God don't do this. Nancy. 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 Why are you so hell-bent on destroying the life of that poor girl? Why? Mom, I asked you for help. And you're here. And you blatantly pretended like you didn't know their location. But here you are, assisting the police to make an arrest, to arrest that poor girl's mom. Why? Think. Can't you think? I'm asking you, as big as you are, can you not make use of your head? Why has she not contacted you all this while? I'm asking you. Why did she reach out for you all of a sudden? Because she needs help from you. Can you not think? Can't you see that this girl is using you? Mom, you are the one using me. Yes. You have entirely messed up my sanity. Ever since I got back to this country, what did you turn my hotel into? A brothel. And here you are, you're still hell-bent on destroying and ruining the relationship that I had with Judith. Can you hear yourself? You've all grown. You stand before me and shout at your mother, right? I'm asking you! Okay, Mom. Let's do it this way. I will pay you every penny, every cobble that she owes you. And once that's done, Please, Mom, kindly hands off her family and ask the police to please release that innocent woman from the police cell. Enough! Stop it! I will never let you lavish your money unnecessarily on those idiots! Get out of my way. Mom, please do this for me. Mom, please. You can do this for me, Mom. Please. Do it for me. Mom. Exactly this. What exactly is the problem? Where have I gone wrong? Nancy, please do not start now, please. I just told you the most important thing is to help me get my mother out of the cell. Are you this selfish? You call me selfish. Nancy, I was threatened at gunpoint. I was kidnapped. I was asked to run for my dear life without my belongings. I went back to the village with nothing, except with a broken heart and a fearful spirit. And you call that being selfish? What else did you expect me to believe when you didn't say anything? I do not want any further troubles from your mother. Please, 
All I'm asking is that you just help me get my mother out of the cell, please. That's where we are going. Okay? Okay. I, I paid my mom the money. She says your mother is owed her. Yes. It so she's instructed million. the police to let her out. So we're going to pick her up. You paid the 2.5 million. Jesus. Please. No, 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 stop, Thank you. Stop, stop, stop. Jesus. Thank you. Thank you. Please let's go. Please go. Now, why is your face like that? You don't look good. And why are you doing this? What did why? you do? What? Now, I've done another transfer of 2.5 million naira, making it 5 million naira. Okay. Mommy, please. I'm, I know why I'm adding please. Please. Instruct the police to release that poor woman. She's just there suffering for nothing. What do you want me to do? I'm asking you. Son, if I knew you would be showering me with so much money, come on, believe me, I would have turned Judith and her mother into business. But listen, this time, it's not all about the money. I have instructed the police to release them, but they refused due to the level of crime those idiots committed. So allow them spend one more night in jail. By tomorrow, they'll be out. Why are you so bent on unleashing punishment oh. on a family that has done nothing to you, mom? Why? Do you derive so much joy in seeing the pain of, of another woman? Now, what would you have me do? Should I do the work for the police people? Should I do their job for them? As in, should I go to the police station and release them by force on my own? Come on, chill. It's just one day night in jail and they'll be out. By the way, thank you for the SS cash. I love that. You know your mother. I love money. I don't mind you sending more. It's our money after all. Tears. So get more wine. Oh, thank you, my son, for all your effort. You're such a good gentleman. Thank you. I appreciate it. You're welcome, man. And uh, by the way, you need to have enough rest. Uh, I can imagine the amount of stress you went through in there. Okay? It is not your fault at all. Hmm? It's not your fault. But thank you very much. I'll leave you too. Okay. Okay, so I'll be I'll be going now. I'm running late already. So so much, Judith. I need you to know this. Not even my mom or anybody can do anything about it. Okay? Okay. I love you too. <laughs> okay. Alright, uh, I have to go now. Okay?
Chief, you ought to have forgotten about this girl by now. I mean, concentrate on you and I. I don't want you to see our relationship as an ordinary one. I'm developing strong feelings for you. No, now, what you pay for? You should say, now, now, don't think I don't the whole speech. Oh, this guy man be this one. If you say, if you pay for it, no connect me to that man again. No give it. If you get your mama, God, no give me, I don't want. This guy man be this one. Now, let me say that better when you pay. You don't deny me, they press me, they do everything. I can't believe that this is coming from you. I, I'm, I'm serious. Why? I am talking about my succulent, sexy looking, ever appealing Judith, and you are here talking about something else. Is it because your son is interested in her? No, 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 no. Not because of that, Chief. Then what? I have even made it categorically clear to my son that that girl will never come into my house. My son will not marry that girl. I'm not going to accept her as my daughter in law. Give her to me. She made me angry, and I sent her packing. And, uh, you know, I have been trying to see if I can convince her to come back, but um, she's not. Listen, Madam Good, eh? <laughs> you are a guru in this business. When it comes to engaging and disengaging these girls, you know exactly how to go about it. I'm not supposed to be the one that will be teaching you. If you want that girl back, you know how to find her. And I am insisting you find her. Oh, Chief, I need you to calm down. What is it, self, that you saw in that girl that is pushing you so hard like this? Now listen to me, Chief. <sighs> Whatever all these young girls are giving to you, I, Madam Gold, can even give it to you much more. I mean, you should have, you know, considered getting married to me by now. Seriously, Madam Good, I don't know why you have allowed your mind to wander off so wide. What the hell is going on? You know exactly what I want, where my mind is. Huh. Chief. Why are you deviating? What, what the hell is going on? I mean, why are you deviating? Why are you not facing what I want you to face? All right, in that case, give me a little time. But I'm good, I'm giving you all the time, but I need you to understand something, that my next visit to this place is not going to be friendly. Because of what we have shared, because of what we have come through, for old time's sake, go out of your way and give me what I want and then stop pushing me. Chief, hold on. Are you threatening me now? You may call it anything, but I think I've made my point clear. But I'm good, I want that girl. And I want that girl desperately. Mm. Do not push me to the wall. You will not like it. Chief, calm down, oh. No. Chief. Chief is Madame Godo. This is indeed serious. Can you imagine? Because of this Philae champion. Eh? Now what am I supposed to do now? Is it to go and beg this girl, kneel down and beg her? Just because of Chief. Go that's all. I beg you. Are you coming from by this time of the night? It's past midnight already. Am I? All right. Let me guess. You went to drop your local champion prostitute and her mother back to the village. Am I right or wrong? Answer me!
Chief, eh, please. I do not know the reason you don't want to rest on this girl's matter. But I gave you my word that I will do everything within my powers to make sure that this girl returns back to you. So why, why are you threatening me this early morning? Ha! Chief, I beg, I beg, I beg, please. Please, it's too early for all this. Be good. What's all this? What is all this, sir? Why is this girl stressing me? A common local champion. Why? It's all because of my son. <laughs> Good morning, Mom. Good morning, sweetheart. Good morning. So, um, I overheard your voice on the phone. You were speaking so loudly. I hope all is well. Were you standing at the door? Oh, no. Uh, I was just coming in when I heard your voice. Oh. Some idiot just called me to spoil my day this morning. I will not let him. Wow. Mm. Come on, is it? Mm. You know you need to take it easy on yourself. Okay? I will. Just came to make myself coffee. Mama. Good day, Mama. Greetings, my dear. How are you doing? I'm fine. I'm fine, Mama. I'm fine. Uh, this one you paid us a visit today. Is everything okay? Yes, yes, uh, Mama. Is, is, is Judith around? I need to see her. It's very urgent. She just stepped out. She will soon be back. Uh, Come sit down and wait for her. Okay. Uh, Do you know what time she will be around? Is everything okay? You're getting me scared. Look at how you're looking around. Everything is okay. I just need to see Judith. Uh, you have nothing to worry about. For sure? Yes. Okay. She will soon be back. Okay. She will soon be back. Yeah. Please. Um, what are you talking about? I sense my mother is up to something. Okay? So I, I, I just need to find somewhere where your mom and yourself will go, at least for a while. Okay? Go to where? Just don't worry. Leave that to me. I'll sort it out. Okay. I, I just want to take you both to somewhere you will be, and that way she won't be able to have access to to both of you. For now. How am I supposed to tell my mother that we need to move from our own house? Baby, it's just for a while. Okay. Please. Mildred, Ma, welcome to my home. Thank you so much. I must say you're... you have a lovely place? Really? Yes. Thank you very much. <laughs> you are beautiful. I know. Thank you. Oh, <laughs> please make yourself comfortable. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Where is your son? Oh, he's not in at the moment. But he will soon be back. Okay, it's just that um, we got to see him. Ah, oh, love a girl. <laughs> Don't worry. I know my son cannot get his eyes off you when he sees you. I know. Mm. All right, sweetheart. You care for something? But mm -hmm. well, I do not feel right about this. I don't want any trouble from Madame Gould. Hmm. I think the young man is doing this to avoid any further trouble. Yeah? You know who the mother is, Madame Gould. Moreover, he's the only one we run to when we have problems. So let's listen to what he's saying. Maybe you never can tell. He must have overheard the mother threatening us. That could be why he's doing what he's doing. So let's listen to him, please. But are you sure about this? Honestly, I'm sure. Let's just go with his plans, please. Oh, gee. Mm. That means um, we'll have to pack our things. We'll leave before weekend. 
Are we packing everything in the house? No, no, just a few things, Mama. That's okay with me. That could be better. Madi, my wife wants to be. Hey! Oh, chill. Okay. I hope you're not going to be able to do it. I'll get the chance. Hey! 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 You're so funny. <laughs> oh, my darling. Mom, yes, darling. Are you sure your son will be back anytime soon? Or maybe he's having fun with his friends? Oh, come on, sweetheart. You do not know my son. He's not the fun and the club type. He's on the quiet side. You would love him. Believe me, I have called him several times. I've sent a message. I'm waiting for his reply. Believe me, soon he'll be back. Okay, uh, I can't wait to see him. You know, I want to see his reactions, you know, if I meet up with his expectations. What are you talking about? My son will love you once he sees you. Really? What if you're just perfect match? <laughs> mm -hmm. I love the sound of that. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank you so much, Mom. <laughs> so I hope you love your drink. Yes, I do. Oh! Daddy boy! Come here, sugar. Mm -hmm. Now, where have you been? Good evening. Good evening. Uh, Mom, I am so sorry about that. I had urgent matters to attend to, so I had to, you know, go somewhere. But the good part is I'm back now. Uh, oh, you should have at least called me. I sent you a text earlier. I guess you didn't see it. That wasn't enough. Okay. Fine. I'm really sorry, Mom. Okay? Okay. okay. So, Mom? Who is she? <laughs> that is the surprise that has been waiting for you. She is mid-red. Beautiful girl, as in Okolo Cassia wine. But that's true. Thank you. I want you and Midred to get along. Believe me, I'm expecting both of you to get married. <laughs> Mom, you have always been funny. Yes. And of course, I know you're not serious this time. Anyways, I just got back and I am really tired. I need to get some rest now. I will talk to you some other time. I'm serious. Of course. You've never been serious. <laughs> What is wrong with him? Oh, Midred, Midred. Never mind his expression. You know, that's how it should be at the beginning. I'm sure he was blushing. But never mind. I'm glad he's back home now. And he's chilling in his room. So I would like you to use this opportunity. This thing you have here. And there. You know, to go to his room, start up a chat with him. Okay, that. But are you sure he will give me a listening ear? Come on, Midred. Such a beauty can be worst. Now listen. Use your magical beauty. Hold him down in the room. Do something. Just do something. Seduce him. I know my son, he'll fall for it. Okay, mom. Go, girl. Come here, you. Mom, please. What is it? No, 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 no. Where are you headed? Mom, I need to be somewhere else. Yes. I mean, mom, you, you want to bring someone into this house for me without my permission. What does that say? 
and my presence here is no longer valued. Mom, I just oh, have to no, go. No, 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 no! Calm down, sweetheart. Take a good look at her. You didn't see her, Vero. Mom. Turn around, spin. Mom, see, look at, look at. Mom, me. mom, please leave. Sweetheart, wait. My hand alone. I need to go. No, you're not going anywhere. Calm down, sweetheart. Piece of advice, and that would be your own interest, okay? My love, what is the problem? Why are you acting like this against me? What's your, what's your love? Look, first, I am not your love. Secondly, I will never have anything to do with you, okay? Why? Am I that ugly? No. I, I'm a married man. My heart belongs to another, okay? And no, you are not ugly. You're pretty. You just need a man that can love you for who you are, who understands your true worth. Not me. So take this advice and go live a better life. Now, Chief, you have beaten more than you can chew. I mean, how dare you lock my business premises for what? Because of that village, good for nothing, girl. Just wait for, for the instructions. They have succeeded in caging my son. Hmm. I will never let that happen. Never. Mama! Mama, be fast now. It's getting late. It looks like it's supposed to rain. Any time you up. You're not up. You're not up. You're not up. Mama, be fast now. Oh! 
You were actually trying to run away. <laughs> oh yeah, come out to beggy beggy boropose. What is wrong with you? Are you mad? Come out fast. Oh, you have finally grown confidence. Now may I know who your backbone is? Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Because you bewitched my son, you now feel you have the nerves to talk back at me? Oh. Madame oh. Barabaro! They've paid you now. Eh? Who paid me? They've paid you. You paid me in your dream? Because you feel you do dirty business. Does not mean no. everyone is as dirty as you are. You aged swan. Oh, shut up! Boys! What are you still waiting for? Is she Madame Gold? Yes, she's the one. You? In flesh and blood. Are you not surprised? You know the nonsense they keep saying that a tree does not make a forest, but they forget. There are plantations we have around that are made up of just one particular kind of tree. I am that tree that has made a forest. Arrest this woman! Your advice to keep silent. Whatever you say will be against you in court of law. You are under arrest. Don't even try to get away. 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 Don't even Hey! Baby, I am really, really sorry for everything that you've gone through in the course of us, this relationship. And I'm so sorry for putting you through all this. And uh, I, I, I want to say that once we do get married, I have to fly you abroad. <laughs> um, what about your mom? Come on. My mom needs to face the law. She is currently facing the law. I mean, I think she deserves to be. So, when she's done facing the law, then we can talk about her. Okay? Baby, I am so happy that we finally ended up together. I couldn't have imagined spending the rest of my life with another man. I'm blessed to be around you forever. I love you so much. I love you too, baby. I am lost and alone. to do anymore Can you hear me crying? Can anybody hear my voice? Who can help me now? Oh, who can save me now? Can you hear me crying? Can anybody hear my voice? Who can help me now? Oh, who can save me now?
better be careful Friends can turn to foes Foes can turn to friends Life is a mystery Oh, you better beware When there is love, there is hope When there is hope, we'll see a future